we got something a little different for you guys today. I'm a variety streamer over on Twitch and I play different games on YouTube. So I play all types of games. And I saw this on Twitter and I had to reach out to them. The guys at Good Shepherd Entertainment have given us a copy of Dice Folk. This is now available on Nintendo Switch. Check this gameplay out. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the Right, okay. So, Dice Folk, new game. Let's do a run. Let's do a run, okay? Um, we've got different talismans here. This is, uh, this is, uh, I've played this off stream, guys. Obviously, we've got early access. Thank you so much to Good Shepherd Entertainment. We have, um, yeah. We haven't, we, we've cleared the first part. Okay, so this is a roguelike game where you use dice and also capture monsters to use them in your, uh, in your playthroughs as you go through. You get, uh, you can play through as many times as you like. Each path is different. So you're not going to get the same path every single time you replay again. If you know the roguelike kind of games like Hades and stuff like that, then you'll understand. This is uh, this is basically similar like that, but I'll try and explain what's going on here uh, as we go along. We do one playthrough. That's the whole point of this video to show you. I'm playing it on the Nintendo Switch, guys. Um, so this is now available. I believe it's out on PC as well. So uh, grab that if PC players. Okay, so we're going to use, we've got different talismans here. We've got Warrior Talisman, Storm Talisman, Wrath Talisman. So we need to do, we need to get to the third world. So we've done the first one. That's why we, that's why we've, really, we've got this second one here. Uh, we didn't beat the second one on my, uh, my couple of goes that we did off, uh, off stream for early access. Thank you again. Uh, Good Shepherd Entertainment. We have, um, yeah, so we haven't unlocked the Wrath Talisman. We've got Pain Talisman which we need to clear the third world. So it just shows you there's at least three, four worlds in there. Sorry, guys. Uh, four worlds in there. Um, okay, so where it says there, just above me here, it says Shrine Chimeras. Okay, so what we can do is, you'll see in a minute, our path has different um, obstacles. We've got battles, we've got elite battles, boss battles, but we've also got shrines as well. So we can get to a shrine and we can find a new chimera in there we can unlock that one use it in your party if you want or just obviously collect it in with this we still got a few more here to collect well, i'll just show it i'll run through it as we, we talk about as we play the game guys we're going to use the warrior talisman the warrior talisman attracts chimeras with great offense capacities it was once worn by a powerful hero so we're going to use this one guys okay we're going to use this now let's see what's going on here Okay, guys, so this is the map. Okay, so this is the first world, okay? We've got to clear this world. We've got to clear the, at least the boss in this world. It does help if you do all the fights because you're obviously getting extra stuff. You're getting extra coins. See in the, uh, the top right there, you've got a coins there. We've got zero coins at the minute. We also have this up here, which is, uh, if you press L on the, uh, on the control pad, uh, this here tokens that we can use in battle. So we can't use them out of battle use these tokens you can't use matter battle so this one here basically this one um if we go over it again heals 50 percent of max hp okay uh, of the ally of the ally team so so we can use this when most of the team are down to at least 50 percent of health uh that will restore their health that will restore everyone's health so don't use it straight away be tactical when you're going to use these okay uh as we do in rpg kind of games right okay so this is our map we can't go we can't go past unless we do these things here we've got battle we've got die smith we've got an elite battle uh and then we've got another battle here the elite battle are stronger battles than this so they have an extra they'll have an extra tough uh enemy involved there uh we've also got chests we've got chest and we've got a die smith so die smith you can buy stuff from these so if we go into his right now you see in the top right corner we don't have any coins we don't have any coins right so we won't be able to purchase any of this stuff here. So these up here, these go where your left are. These go up here. Uh, basically, this this is this one here. Team gains an amount of uh, an amount of gold equal to its lead, leader's strength. So that's what we'll do. Um, ends current turn and rerolls all dice. That's another one as well. This one, this one here. Go. Okay. Play a dice let. A small die that lasts only for one battle. These are perfect for boss battles okay so basically when i go into the first fight you will see we've got three dice uh and what what we will do is uh, we've got to roll these dices uh it's, it's basically these ones over here um if i just go here these ones here 
we've got an attack one, we've got a rotate one, and we've got a shield um, or, at, uh, or, or, or strength bust. Strength bust, sorry, buff. <laughs> um, right, okay. And then what we can do, we can use this in a fight and it will add a fourth dice. Uh, this will have extra stuff, um, stronger abilities as well. Um, so this is this is only available for that fight that you use this. So this is probably decent to use during a boss fight. So we'll come back and buy this for a boss fight. That's what we need. Uh, we've also got the abilities here. So these abilities here, once you buy these, you got 15, 30 and 9 coins. Once you buy these, you actually put them on your dice. You put these on your dice. So these ones up here go on the top left up here. And these ones at the bottom go on your dice. So obviously we've got a guard. We're going to have an extra guard there. Right at the minute, you can see we've got a timer, 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 timer. This is, these are idle, so they don't do anything whatsoever. So get these bottom three here. Add them onto the warrior die. Um, like this one here. Target any chimera on the ally side. It attacks the enemy leader. There we go. So um, Also here, without attacking... Leader deals an amount of damage equal to its strength to the opposing leader. So I'll show you about strength in a minute. So on the um, oh, camera's mirrored, uh, on the right-hand side here, you've got a sword and you've got a number next to it. So you've got four strength, five strength, and six strength. So that is what this energy shock is dealing. So uh, leader deals an amount of damage equal to its strength to the opposing leader. So if my leader there, number six, that's got six strength. So that will use uh, a six strength um attack against uh against their leader obviously right now we can't buy any of these so i'm just showing you this for the sake of um sake of this video dice folk guys i've really really enjoyed my time with this this is basically um you can play this for as long as you like you can, every single map is different you can see there we've got we've got three shrines it looks like in the distance what we do we go to the chest we might get some coins in the chest Okay, we've got a horse figure. On spawn, if in the lead, gains five regen. If not, gains three. So at least it's either five or three. At least it's going to get something. Where it says equipment now, guys. So where it says equipment, what we can do is we come out of this and we'll go down to here. We've now got a horse. We've got this horse here. So we can give this to a person. We can equip it to one of our fighters here. Um, this one's got six uh, strength so we're going to be using this one more surely so we'll add it to this and that means at the end of the turn an effective chimera heals itself for an amount of hp equal to the regen value so if we are winning uh it will get five regen if we are losing we will get three it's still better than nothing guys it's still better than nothing okay so and next to it we've unlocked battle so what we do we're going to jump into a battle now guys we're going to jump into this battle this is quite easy to get the hang of, actually. So um, I'll just explain it to you. I've never played a game like this before. It's got so many different elements into it. Uh, but I'm a, yeah, I'm a big fan of this. Okay, so guys, just want to make sure the uh, the music's not too loud for you. Yeah, I think we're good. I think we're good. Okay, so we've got uh, we've got three people. They've got two people. We've got our three dice down here. Which what I'm going to do is I'm going to move myself. I'm going to move myself here. Uh, I'm going to move... Let's put T.S. Villa up here. To be fair, we could probably... Sorry, guys. This is uh, this is me reacting live. <laughs> okay. You'll understand in a minute because we do need to see everything, even that uh, end turn bit. Okay. So, right at the bottom here, we've got three dice. These are our three dice that I mentioned earlier. We've got idle. We had four of them. We've got idle, we've got rotate, and we've also got the attack, okay? So this reckless attack, if we press X, uh, this incapacitates itself. So what we want to do is try and use less of these. If we can get abilities later on to buy in the shops, we can uh, we can replace these so we don't hurt ourselves, okay? Um, also, they have two dice, okay? They've got a rotate. They've also got an idle as well. So they can't do anything but rotate. We have to do this for them, though. So if we want to beat up uh, Mohammed, then what we can do is um, keep him there. But if we wanted to rotate it, we can change to Boglin if we want. Okay, so if we want to change 
um, our leader, we just rotate. But what we're not going to do, we're not do that. We're going to reckless attack it. Okay. We should be in the lead, which means he's get a five regen as well. There's the regen. Okay. Right. We can either leave it or not. Um, and we'll just rotate them. Now we don't need to rotate, but it's asking us now: Do we want to? Do we want to change it? I say no because we've got a strongest person out, and also he's got regen as well. Um, okay, so we're going to end our turn here. There's there's a regen. Okay, a five regen it is. Okay, okay. So here we've got uh, idle, so we can't rotate them. Uh, we've also got a clash attack as well. That's that's for them. This purple side is for them. Okay, these are our three here. We've got another idle. We get, we can either rotate your man or we can hit again. So he was obviously purple earlier because he he uh, incapacitated himself. Um, we can't rotate or we could defeat uh, uh, Muhammad there. So we're just going to hit Boglin again. There we go. So reckless attack because he incapacitated himself again. Okay, clash attack. It will always hit the leader here. But we're still in the lead. Which means, there's the regen guys. So we've got three left on that regen. These are uh, abilities that are going to constantly change every single playthrough. This is a roguelike game guys, okay? Uh, it's based on dice. Okay, so if we want to now kill Boglin, what we can do... Uh, so not Boglin, uh, Mahamut, because he's the bigger one. He's the bigger one here, okay? We can rotate. So we've used their rotate. We've used it before we've used our attack. We can get um, our Chimera. Absolutely nail him. We got three gold for that now, guys. So we've got three. Got uh, we've got a gold. Uh, we're gonna leave. Uh, we're gonna leave that out. We're gonna let him take a hit again. But he's reacted there. He's reacted with a six, which is pretty cool. Okay. So we're gonna end. We're not gonna rotate. This guy's gonna regen again. Okay. So we can range attack. This will. This is gonna kill it. Okay. So, so I thought at the minute right now it was going to tell us how many hit points it takes off here, but it doesn't. So if you click on it, um, it will it will then show you. See where it's got underneath Boglin? You've got the two. Now you've got the zero. So we know this hit's going to kill him. Okay? Okay. That was a relatively easy fight. Uh, that's a good starting fight. There's our victory. GG's, guys. GG's. Uh, that's five. We got five gold just for that one fight, uh, which we can use in the uh, the die shop. But, uh, die smith, sorry. Uh, but we've also got an abandoned tent here. We've got the boss fight here. So what we want to do is collect as much stuff as possible in the and then buy some stuff in the die smith or the shop. You'll see the shop later on uh, in this. Um, we obviously bypass the uh, the chest here. Um, let, oh, we got the chest, didn't we? We got the chest. Okay, so we got the abandoned tent uh, and we got the Chimera Shrine. Okay, so this Chimera Shrine is where we uh, unlock uh, our um chimeras for the main page you saw on the main page there uh, with the warrior talisman okay so we have um i don't believe we need to go to the abandoned tent yet because uh okay we've got a travel bag so this gives an extra equipment slot to someone we're obviously going to be using your man here we're going to be using him so let's give him the extra equipment slot uh, that doesn't that doesn't ruin anything whatsoever. We haven't buffed anyone yet, so we might as well go to the Chimera Shrine and have a look. Let's have a look and see who is who we're getting. Looks like a bird. Oh, that looks pretty cool for a bird, doesn't it? Enter lead, attacks the opposing leader. Go on. Okay, so we got Armondoro. Armondoro. There we go. Sorry, guys. <laughs> had, to, had to work that out. Had to work that out. Okay, so we got Armandomo. Okay, he is an attack five. As you see, he's got um, he's got uh, he's got eighteen health, five attack, and one defense. But he's got an extra lead there. Okay, so do we sacrifice our eighteen five, or do we sacrifice the guy that's just behind me here? He's got a twenty and a four. Um, I reckon that extra one. That extra one is going to be really helpful. So let's let's sacrifice him. So now this is our team. If I just take my camera off for a second. Um, there you go. You can see there we've got a 6-5-5 uh, a five, five attack. Uh, but this one has a special ability. So that's uh, that's pretty awesome. Right, we're going to grab that. It's a new one as well. So I've not seen this one. So this is going to go on our main page. We're going to collect these every time we do a run. 
that's the most important thing here guys so even if you fail this one run here you've collected a new chimera okay we're not going to do a leap battle we're going to go down to this one here because the path is free it allows us to actually go down here okay so we've got five gold and we've got some abilities that are going to activate during a battle which is going to help us now we're fighting three people here guys she rolls the dice okay so this we didn't have this last time guys we have the first dice that kept hitting idle it has now got guard okay so if we are using our 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 chimera here as our main one we might as well stick it as guard okay um this guy has already been hit um what he can do here is we can hit him we'll hit him for four and what they can do here is they can kill him because we've got a guard up it's going to bounce back and hit him so he's reflected we've lost our guard they've lost their chisley is called chisley there we go okay so we don't need to rotate um uh well i'll tell you what we do we rotate it's a random rotator so you either get a left or a right or a random okay so i thought uh i'm on Dor i'm on doro was going to come through we're going to rotate the boggling just for the sake of it okay so we've got another there you go the regen just 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 did there okay so we've got a range attack here from your man here or we can random rotate okay we're back here so we're back in back in the same spot again we've got eight gold so this is why we do these fights okay we could you could chance it and go to the elite battle and then the boss battle if you want if you want to rush everything or you want to build up your gold so you can get the extra add-ons okay so there we go so we get the range this is a this is a six hit uh we're gonna enemy eminent uh, enemy range that's fine we'll take that we are winning at the minute we have to rotate them just to use the ability there uh which means we can now press y to end the turn He's absolutely steel, isn't he? Steel with the uh, the regen there. Okay, so again, we've now got the guard. May as well guard him. We're going to attack. Uh, what we're going to do, actually, we're going to rotate. We're going to attack him. And then we're going to get this guy to attack. But we've got the guard up, okay? Um, here we go. If, if in the lead, attacks the opposing leader. So that's basically what it is. That's on spawn, though. So that's fine. That literally ends the turn. We're all good here. We're all good. So we've got another. We've got an ability here that incapacitates themselves. Um, use that. Bang. Okay. We still lead him. We still lead him. Okay. We might as well hold this up. This is going to be a guard. We're going to smack, and then we're going to guard against this. So we're fine there and we are i'm going to rotate this one guys so we you get to use bang now he's a lead he attacks the leader so these are the things you got to think about some of these chimeras have special abilities on okay guys right okay that's that and that's unlocked a shrine chest which has got five gold in it it's also got stuff like this so revives and or lightly heals the chimera of your choice okay we're all good with stuff like that uh lightly heals the whole team so i'm not too sure if we leave it says skip we can't we can't put that in the we need that imagine if we could put that in the bag that would be absolutely awesome um revise and lightly heals lightly heals the whole team let's let's grab that they don't really need it and what i'm going to do is you will lose some uncollected loot are you sure you want to skip yeah so we will lose our we will lose our loot so what we need to do is um don't skip guys don't skip okay you may as well use it um not that we do need it um everyone's all full health aren't they so okay so we're all good there we're all good there's the elite battle uh we've got 17 coins guys let's have a look see if there's anything that we um that we can buy that is gonna that's gonna boost us okay so we've got an extra guard here we've got target any chimera on the aloe side it attacks the enemy leader without attacking leader deals an amount of damage equal to it this i think energy shock is quite good so without attacking so this is an extra attack okay uh strength for the opposing leader okay so we want someone with high strength on this one okay uh when we get it but what i'm going to do is instead of idle 
we're gonna really we're gonna release some of these idols so we've got obviously these ones here reckless attack that incapacitate ourselves um i'm there are going to be times where you're going to need to not do anything but uh ideally you'd want a guard and you'd want a uh, bulk up as well which uh, gives you two strength uh i'm going to use it here and here so at least we get these on the extra instead of actually having them here is a bit of a smart thinking for you guys instead of having them on the attacking side here we've got idle here so we've got extra attacks so we can have roll that 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 and we've got two attacks there um so that's what we're going to do there uh that used uh was that nine coins so we've got eight coins left um we can we can buy one of these but this is more for gold uh ends current turn and re-rolls all dice that could be uh that's kind of like a uh a fail safe i suppose if, if we we're actually getting into trouble um okay so i reckon what we need next is this one here so but we can't buy it yet because we've only got eight coins let's leave that for a minute And let's uh, let's go up here. Oh, who's this? Kitsuna. Okay, see what we got. We've got it straight away. Instead of an idol, we've got it straight away. So grab the energy, energy shock here. Bang! There we go. And now we've got another attack on top of that. Which is going to uh, which is going to kill it? Uh, no, it isn't. It's not going to kill it. We've got two left. Uh, this has got an entangle. So what does that do? Inflicts entangle on the opposing leader. An effective Chimera misses its next rotation as the leader and must try to rotate once in order to end its condition. Okay, so misses its next rotation. So that's fine. So that's that one rotation done. That means we can't rotate out, which is fine. Uh, turn start. So they've got a plus six boost. GG's. But we are gonna we're gonna we're gonna kill it here. We're gonna kill it. We got an idol then, which means we couldn't do anything with that. There's a victory. There she is. Okay, grants uh one strength to the chimera of your choice. Oh, I think we are uh, I think we're in love with your man here, so but we could even it out. Do we wanna boost him or do we want it do you wanna even it out with uh with yeah, let's even it out. So we've got two sixes now. Okay. You see there, I've just put the uh, I've just put two sixes on your bird, uh, which is uh, it's better it's better to even that out. Lightly heals the whole team. We might as well use it because we're going to lose it. Once we leave this screen, we're going to lose it, so we might as well use it. Okay. What do you think of the game so far, guys? Let me know in the comments. This is... Uh... Okay, so we found a bonfire. So bonfires, if you're familiar with uh, stuff like Elden Ring and stuff like that, these give you... Um, you can restore the whole party. Uh, give you stat boosts and I think the other one is uh, an extra equipment slot at the minute We don't have we've only got one equipment. That's it. So we don't really need the extra equipment slot. We've got full health um, uh, Do we need the stats? We would probably need the stats when we jump into uh, the boss fight So what we'll do we'll, we'll leave that because once we go into it, we can't come back out of it uh, Without collecting everything. So we're gonna leave it for a minute um, At least you know you got that in the bank there. Okay, so we're fighting, a, we're fighting a three here. The Boglins are back. Mink pocket. Okay, now we've got the energy shock. Boglin is off. Okay, so we've got this. And if we can... It's a random rotation. If we can get the... Uh, Amondo, right? There we can. Okay, that's fine. And this is a random rotation as well. We'll run Mink pocket. He's now leader. Our other guy is now leader. We're going to rotate this. So we've got the proper, the stronger guys, leader. Um, they've got idle, so they can't attack. But we have to rotate them. We have to do at least one action. Okay, that's one action. Okay, so we've got Boglin again. He's dead. There's two gold from that, so we've got seven, back to 17 gold. We're back to your man here, who's going to take a hit. But he's also defended himself. Uh, right, okay, so he's de defended himself by hitting back. Um, we can, we're going to rotate, there we go, so as soon as he rotates this guy, his special ability is he attacks the lead on switch, um, so we've just switched him, that's why we had random rotations, that's why I couldn't get him, I was trying to get him to the front, but it kept going to the other guy, okay, so we've got another token here, these are the tokens that go to the top left, okay, inflicts an arm, amount of burn equal to alloy's leader, strength on the opposing leader, there we go, so this basically, 
When attacked, an affected Chimera takes an amount of additional damage equal to burn value. Okay, so this is pretty cool. Uh, we're going to grab this. Um, this will burn every single time. Every single time, guys, uh, on uh, activation. Okay, so this unlocked another shrine chest. Uh, and also, we got a battle down here. We got brood berries. Um, let's see what these are. Okay, grants plus one strength to the chimera of your choice. Okay, we gave it the bird last time, but we're gonna give it your we're gonna give it your man here. So now he's he's seven strength. Okay, we are building up. We are building up our um, our team. This is our team for our run uh, to try and get as far as we can. Um, from the looks of it, it looks like there's four worlds. There might even be more um, as we go along. We might go to like the third world, and then it will go fourth, fifth, sixth unlocked, uh, and then basically um that's what i'm trying to say <laughs> we don't know i don't know how many worlds there are there are over a hundred chimeras in this game guys um okay so we've got three gold there so we're on 22 now uh we've also got revives and lightly heals the chimera of your choice everyone is uh, full health i think your man here isn't actually yeah let's get him he is there uh, we've got a shop here okay so we had the uh, we had the die smith and now we've got the shop they both similar things similar things uh, we can buy stuff here. They just have different items, okay? Ends current turn and re-rolls the dice. So we had that one earlier. Target a KO'd ally Chimera. Revives it and heals 50% of their max HP. That is clutch. I have done two runs of this, guys. And I've not seen that yet. So that is clutch. Here's a dice. A small die that lasts only for one battle. Okay, that is that's the thing we were talking about earlier. On spawn, re uh, gains Relentless. Relentless and effective Chimera survives one fatal attack and is left with one HP. Oh, that's quite good. Uh, ally code. This item's holder strongly heals. Ooh. So, how? How do I, do I press X? No. Okay, I can't read more than that. On spawn, if in the lead, gains 2 plus strength for the rest of the battle. If not, gains 2 plus intelligence. So it gains something. A stat that is not found on all chimeras. It represents the blinking value within a chimera's effects. Your current team doesn't have this stat. So we don't have any initiative. Okay. So that's what we're going to get on later. What's interesting for me, this item's holder strongly heals. So does this mean we get knocked out? That's interesting. Also, Relentless is interesting. But I am a bit partial to the old uh, player dice look. So we can grab this. And that's at the top. This is this is more for the boss fight, guys. Okay, it's sold out as well, so you can only buy one of them. Uh, target a KO'd uh, ally chimera, revives it, and heals 50% of the max health. That is also interesting as well. I want to grab that. But this, I am genuinely not too sure. I'm, uh, normally, you could press X, and it tells you, tells you more. But that's the item's holder strongly heals. But when? When they're, when they're low on health? We've got a few more fights, guys. Let's see if we can do something with these anyway. Okay, so we grab these. Uh, we've got two there. So let's see if we can get 16 coins, and then we'll buy that. We'll buy that one next, guys. We'll buy that one next. We didn't get any equipment. We just got stuff for the top row. Uh, let me just confirm that. Yeah, no equipment, just stuff for the top row. That dice will make these into a four. So we get four hits. Okay, four attacks, sorry. Okay, let's jump into this. There we go. Muhammad is back. There you go. That's a hit on spawn. Regen on uh, regen on spawn. Uh, this is going to. I tell you what we can do. If we swap. If we swap this, bang. There's a hit. Um, let's hit him with that, and then we incapacitate. But then we can use this. That's fine. Okay. And now he's going to get hit with a clash. Don't think there's a, yeah there's no there's no rebound no retaliation on that. Um, we are going to there yeah, okay that's that one. We rotated the five for the six then. Okay um, we're gonna have to take the hit. Um, who's gonna take the hit? This guy this guy's got a regen. So now he regens. He took the hit. Now he regens. Okay that's what I was that's what I was hoping. Mohammed's gone. Off he goes. 
Right, now we've got eight coins. We've got to collect these coins, guys. Get, get these coins. Get these coins. Okay, that's that one down here. This is a scroll master. What is a scroll master? A chimera emerges from the scroll. Isn't that what we've got? Took a look. Take a look at my latest art, Larger Than Life. So this is a uh, Armando. Eh? This is what we've already got. But it's a level five. Everything's the same stats as Bell Belloid B. Uh, but he also attacks the opposing leader on switch, which I think is awesome. We didn't we didn't buff we didn't buff the other guy. So let's use this because on rotation we're going to get an extra hit. You see, every time every time he rotated, the bird came in and hit him. That's that is a uh, that's an extra hit, guys. That's an extra hit, and if we can get an energy shock as well, that's three shots in one go. Okay, the uh, we've got the die smith again here. The next thing is either the elite or the boss battle. Finally, a customer. I'm on a roll. Here we go, die smith. Ends current turn. Uh, team gains an amount of gold equal to its leader's strength. Ah, oh, right. Okay. We're trying to get gold, aren't we? We're trying to get gold, but I don't think we are because we just spent the eight. Lead against guard. Yeah, we've got nothing here. We've got nothing here anyway. Okay. Let's head up. I don't want to head up to the bonfire yet. I think we can go to the elite battle. Let's give the elite battle a go, guys. It's the whole point. We do a whole run. We've got a new chimera. If we die, we die. We just start again. We've unlocked that chimera. Here we go. Oh, and the leader. Straight in there with the regen as well. So we've got the energy shock. Um, what we can do is hit is the strongest. Okay. But if we rotate now, we get an extra hit. So that's that's the hit we're on about. Oh, he's hit me back. He's hit me back there. Um, I guess we'll, we'll take another hit. And we'll have to rotate him out. Okay. Okay, so if we rotate right, it's going to rotate the other guy. It's going to rotate the other guy. Okay, but what we need to do is he needs to be the one to take the hits. So what we'll do, we'll, we'll give him a guard. We'll hit him here. He's incapacitated. No more opponent dice. And we will attack him. We have to rotate again. Uh, there was a regen then, but he hasn't been hit yet. Okay, so what we can do again, we can attack. We take seven off there. We'll take seven off there. That's pretty decent. So we can kill this guy right now. Let's kill him. Okay. With two attacks. Then we'll spin. Bang. There he is. Dead. Okay, so we're getting hit every time we use all... If we had if we had a, a, a dice left and then we moved on to them, we wouldn't get hit. But this uh, this Armantis is hitting us because we've used all our die. Okay. Um, okay, so... He's only a two strength, so we want to use the two strength and get them out of the way. Okay. And we're going to rotate. Let's go. Turn end in. Let's give us a little buff then. Okay, random rotation. What we want to do is hope. Nope, we didn't get him. Okay, right. Let's hit him with this, and then we've got a seven, seven slot here. I'm incapacitated. He's just re. Uh, he's hit me back there. He's retaliated. Okay, this is fine. Strength up. Right, what we're going to do? I'm going to rotate though. I'm going to rotate because it's definitely going to hit him. There's a hit. Strength up. Hit him again. No more opponents' dice. We got hit then because we had no more dice again. Uh, right, so. We want to get hit by this because he's only got two. Our Mantis has got four strength. Okay, we're all good. We're all good. Rotate right, which means uh, we're going to get hit. Bang. Our Mantis is gone. Uh, we're going to get incapacitated as well by doing this, but it doesn't matter because he is dead. We've won. Victory!
GG's. We got an ice sword. Okay, this is an equipment attack. Small chance of inflicting frozen on the target. An attack against a, 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 a effective primary deals 100% of damage. Uh, we've also got a mirror. Leader repeats the previous actions used except idle. Even if it originated from an opponent or a token. So if they do something, we can repeat that. Okay, ice sword. Yes, 100%. Mirror. I think we need to get rid of the idols. Um, I suppose we could have it. We could have it in here as well, so we can have three attacks. Let's get rid of the idols. Um, I suppose no, no, no. What, what, what? I, what I think I'll, we need is we need them here. If we get them here, then we can at least um, have one, two, three. Because obviously, if we get it here, then we can't really repeat unless it's this. We can't re repeat this. Um, okay, right. That was a bit foolish of me. But with, um, yeah, sorted. There we go. All good. There we go. Right. Okay. So we've got ten. We've got ten now, guys. We've got ten gold. And the next thing we need to do is the boss battle. That was the elite battle. It was a little bit harder than the other battles. We've got 10. We can't really buy anything. I mean, we've got this. End turns and re-rolls all dice. I mean, what? Could we... Could we use all our dice and then end the turn before they do anything? Is that what it's saying? I don't know what that I think that's what it means. We can have our we can have our go and then end the turn. Instead of them actually having a go themselves. I haven't forgotten about the bonfire by the way guys. Um that is something I wanted to leave until we just go into the boss fight. Okay. Team gains an amount of gold equal to its leader's strength. Okay, so that's gonna be seven. Um end current turns and re-rolls all dice. See it's there again. Right, what I'm, what I'm going to do, I'm going to go to the bonfire first. See what we can get from the bonfire. Because I think we need to uh, we need to heal everyone. Yeah, we need to heal everyone. Uh, what to do? Okay, so we've got... There we go, we've got options here. Revives and strongly heals all chimeras. Strongly heals. Uh, slightly increases a random stat of every chimera. So that's every single one of them, but it's a random stat. Uh, we've also got equipment slots, but we've only got the ice sword, which I'm going to equip in a minute. Uh, what we need now, obviously, we don't have any um, items to heal. We have to use these to heal. Uh, so we used the bush earlier um, and stuff in the chest, and we've got this. So we're going to use this, revives and strongly heals all chimera. So now we're, we are not 100% because uh, the Armando, Armandoro, I'm literally going to be struggling to say that every single time. Um, I was hoping we were going to get a... Um, uh, some gold. Right, okay. Should we get it? Should we get it and try it out? Ends current turn and re-rolls all dice. I think we should try that out. Okay. Because we've only... We've, no. There's nothing else to... There's nothing else to buy with five. Um, like we couldn't buy any abilities. I could do with another idol disappearing. Yeah, we couldn't buy any more abilities, so that's fine. I don't know. Yeah, you can only have a maximum of five. Then okay, I just thought I'd try that out as well while I was here. You ready for the boss battle, guys? You ready for it? Here we go. Here we go. Okay. So what we what we're gonna do here? Uh, small chance of inflicting frozen on the target. Okay. Who are we gonna give this to? Are we gonna give this to? We're we gonna give this to our man. He's got everything, hasn't he? Yeah, let's give it him, guys. We're absolutely <laughs> tanking him up. We're tanking him up. Okay, guys. Okay, we're heading to the boss. Okay, guys? Wish us luck. Remember, we've got all this stuff at the top here. And the first thing I'm going to do, I'll show you in a second, is the battle starts. Okay, look, the boss has got... Okay, Strizzly... He's got 90 health. 
Okay, I'm going to go up to the top. So I'll press my L stick. And what we're going to do, we're going to add an extra dice to the bottom. We're going to use it. Now, for this whole fight, we have four dice to use. Okay, so we could effectively uh, fight, uh, attack three times plus the rotation. That's four times as well. Okay, what else have we got on the top here? We've got heals. Okay, so if we ever need the heals, we've got the heals here. Uh, inflicts an amount of burn equal to allies leader strength on the opposing leader when attacked an affected chimera takes an amount of additional damage equal to burn value so burn would be quite good targets are care okay so when someone gets knocked out we can use this uh ends current turn and revolves all okay so what i'm gonna do use this now we're gonna use this so he's burnt that's fine. This is the boss. So we're absolutely nailing the boss right now. Um, here, over here, so just uh, just over here, we've got... This is the boss. Okay, the boss gets his own little thing here. So they've obviously got this and this, which are normal at attack and movement. Um, and this is also the boss as well. Okay, let's... Uh, what we're going to do, we're going to use your man here. Okay. He's also got ice as well. So he's going to attack. Who do we attack? We can get rid of these, or we can just keep attacking the, uh, the boss. Um, inflicts two bleed on the target every time its team rotates an effective chimera takes an amount of bleed down. okay so we don't we have to make him rotate but hopefully we don't uh, allow him to okay so that's two hits then we're going to rotate guys we're going to rotate it's a random rotation he's going to hit he's down half his health already and that is just on our first turn okay guys um right What we want to do he's only he's only a four strength that's the thing so let's rotate him this guy's going to attack uh the boss has swapped back in so he's rotated back in but he didn't attack we made sure he didn't attack now we can end the turn and then we can jump over here now look at this look at this our fourth dice all attack let's have a look at what this says attacks all opponents that is awesome and that is, that is just by using that extra dice. Okay. I don't know if I should be calling it die or dice. <laughs> Either way, please don't comment. Please don't comment. Okay, we're going to all attack. But what we're going to do, we... Uh, yeah, we're going to do it here. Because we're not going to we're not gonna risk it for one. There we go. So let's see. There we go. Back him again. So we swapped over. He's an extra hit. Oh, these are, these are pretty good shots. These are good shots. Look at that. It was almost done. Okay. So we're going to rotate him out again. Just so the boss doesn't actually attack us. Uh, right. He's going to... I'm going to make him attack this guy because he's got the uh, he's got the barrier. But that's rotated him. And this guy's rotated in. The boss is about to go down. Okay. So we're going to range attack. What we can do for this one is we might as well just rotate... That gets rid of the boss. I wonder if we only have to beat the boss. Ah, okay. There you go. I didn't know this. I didn't know that. I thought we had to defeat the pack. But no, you only have to be defeat the boss. So if we kept rotating and beating other guys up, that would have been a longer, longer fight. Um, there we go. <laughs> I learned something new. I hope you have. Okay, equipment choice. Let's see what we've got here. Nova. I like the sound of that. Attacked. Once per battle, inflicts blind on all opponents. Uh, every oh, so I guess when the guy's attacked, inflicts blind on everyone. An affected chimera misses its next attack and must try to attack once in order to end its condition. So you can't wait it out. So once you've been hit by blind, you can't wait it out. Uh, you have to attack for it then to miss for then your next turn to actually happen. We've got asteroid belt. Uh, rotation deals three damage to all opponents. Every time, so on rotation, every time we rotate, uh, it will hit three damage, which is why uh, sometimes it's more um, um, crafty to actually uh, to rotate out. Like we were rotating before we were hitting because we were getting the extra hits on the rotation. We got Void Compass, KO'd, grants its strength to the ally with the most strength for the rest of the battle. Okay, so that means whoever's wearing this, if they die, and they've got, let's just say, they've got six strength. Uh, they will pass it on to the next person with the most. So that'd be the seventh strength. So, oh man. Okay, that's pretty decent. But 
We don't want to be thinking about dying, guys. We don't want to think about dying. Um, rotation is pretty... That's a pretty decent one. Blinds are pretty decent one because everyone misses their next attack. Once per battle, inflicts blind on all opponents. So everyone will miss their next attack. An effective Chimera misses its next attack and must try to attack once in order to end it. Yeah. But we have got the deals three damage on all rotations. So three damage is going to be quite... To all opponents as well. That's going to be quite good. But do we want to stop people attacking? I think we do. Oh, this is where this is where live streaming really, really helps, guys. Because um, I, I stream over on Twitch. Uh, live streaming, I'll always ask my chat. I'll be like, what do we do? What do we do? I think we should blind them. Because I would rather... I know we're doing three damage on everyone. Which is well, it's basically half our strength, isn't it? Which is that's quite decent. But I would rather them miss their next shot. Because they miss their next shot. So they could be blinded for a while. Yeah, let's get blind. Let's get blind. I think I've done the right thing there. Let me know in the comments, guys. Please let me know. <laughs> let me know in the comments if you're shouting at your screen going, Villa, no. Do not go for that one. Do not go for that one. Okay, so this is the second map. Oh, we've got a Jawa here. What's all that about? <laughs> right, what we're going to do, we need to equip this though. We need to equip this. Uh, this is going to be inflict blind on opponents. Okay. Small chance of inflicting frozen on target. What, what I'm going to do is unequip this. We're going to have blind on him because he's always going to get hit. I was just checking then, because I thought he'd lost some health when I equipped it. But he didn't. Okay. We're going to equip this to uh, your man here. He's he's stronger. Okay. I'm happy with that. That was a good one. That was good. And we got the Chimeras as well. Okay, we got an elite battle straight away. We got a Traveller. I don't know what a Traveller does yet. Um, before we jump into him, let's see how strong these battles are. We haven't healed. Unless it's healed for us. Has it healed us from the boss fight? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Oh, ho, ho. straight out the bat, he's gone for a little dig. He's gone for a little dig. Uh, we may as well bulk up, guys. May as well. Uh, well, actually, we're gonna hit him. Random taunt, free rotation, clash. Um, I tell you what, he's a seven anyway. Mirror. Mirror is going to hit him again. Or oh, we can bulk up. Nine. Mirror. Eleven. Oof. That's naughty, isn't it? Uh, random taunt. We'll get rid of those. That's done something to him. Clash attack. Uh, we've, oh, we've, we've, we've replied there. So they've got 10 and 12 strength. Look at that. Okay. He's got no strength now. Okay. Why has he got down to no strength? I'm just trying to think. Maybe we can hit him with this. Mirror. He's dead. He's KO'd, but in, for some reason he's, he's, he's his own mate. Now we swapped him over, so now they got the rotation there. This guy here, he's hit himself. Is that because he's. Is that because of the taunt, or is that because of the blind? It's worked out in our favour either way. Uh, rotation. Let's come back to your man here. Let's give him another strength. So that strength boost for the mirror was only was only for that turn. It wasn't for the rest of the fight. GG's. That was a good victory, wasn't it? That was a good victory. Okay, we've got a chest here. We've got some debris as well. What's in the debris? Passive. Slightly increase one or more multiple random stats. Ooh. Okay.
We have to equip it, don't we? Oh, he's got a plus one strength. GGs. Now he's on par with everyone else. Beautiful. Okay. Uh, let's jump in the chest, see what's going on here. Uh, attack. Once per battle, gain six regen. At the end of the turn, an effective combo area heals itself with an amount of HP equal to the regen value. At the end of the turn, an effective calm area heals itself for an amount of the HP equal to the regen value. But it just says six. So that's the regen value. So that's probably better than this. When he attacks. Uh, we're going to equip that and we will equip this because that's a definite because he's always going to attack whereas this on spawn if in the lead gains 5 regen if not gains 3 at the end of the turn an effective combo area heals itself for an amount of HP equal to the regen value so that's 5 but that's if we're in the lead this is if it ta attacks so I would say keep the horse uh, and equip that equip that there at least at least he's going to attack then and he? he's going to attack okay no tell you what this is what I'm thinking this is what I'm thinking guys sorry guys he's going to attack more this guy's going to be more rotation, so at least if we're in the lead, he's still going to get his regens, isn't he? He's going to get his regens. We've got Chimera Shrine. What are we going to unlock? Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Some kind of fish. Oh, he's only got two attack, though. Uh, ally attack. If not in the lead, attacks the same target as ally wants. Okay, so if he's not in the... If he's not the leader... And we, uh, if not in the lead, attacks the same targets Allo wants. Okay, so he's going to attack as well as me. Um, I don't know if, uh, we're going to recruit him. Let's have a look. I wouldn't want to replace him with anyone, to be fair. No offence, dude. We've unlocked him, but I feel bad, man. I feel bad. He's down there at the bottom. He's down there on your bottom right. Okay. Um, I feel like we should speak to the traveller, but let's go. Let's go for another. Let's go for another battle. We should get some regens with these. Okay, so 28, 26, and 30 health. Way more than what I've got here. Okay, energy shock. This is decent. Okay, which means we need to mirror that. Uh, and okay, we just nailed him. He's gone. He's gone. What we do want to the off off is uh, he's got a ten strength. Uh, so we've just rotated him out, rotated him. Okay, that's fine. So we don't need the ten on us. We don't want that on us. Now they're blind. Okay, now they're blind. They have to hit us. Uh, they have to attack us to cure the blinds. Um, right. Energy shock again. Happy with that. And that. And then we'll do that. Beautiful. Okay, that is a good run. That's a mirror. Mirror on the second dice is a great play. Uh, he's he's asleep. Your man's asleep. Okay. Mm. Uh, what we're gonna do? We're gonna shield. There we go. Bang. Uh, shield him and also attack. We're gonna attack here. Okay. He's awake now, but he's missed. Because he was blind. That is why we equipped it. Awesome. Okay, so same again. The shield is still on us. Uh, this is a random rotation though. So we're going to hit him. We could just kill him. Let's just see if the rotation kills him. No, it doesn't. Okay, there we go. So he had six left, but we had seven, we had seven uh, strength there. Beautiful. The mirror. Mirror token. Leader repeats the previous action used, except idle. Okay, so we've got an, we've got a mirror up here as well. So even if we don't get it on the dice, we've got it up here. We could do with another equipment slot, to be fair. Put that ice on it. 
Ice sword on someone. Stone hand. What's on the... We're working this out together, guys. We're working this out. Equipment choice. Here we go. King of sloth. A ring of sloth. King? Ring. On equip, gains uh, between 0 and 8 strength at random. Once equipped to a chimera, this item cannot be unequipped. It's cursed. Oh, they're all cursed. Grants plus one item slot to its allies. Once equipped to a chimera, this item cannot be unequipped. So this gives an extra slot to someone else. Uh, revives and or heals the whole team. Once on equip. Revives and heals the whole team. Want to equip to require more this? Uh, okay, so I stopped reading that. That's just that. Revives and or heals the whole team. On equip. Okay, so as soon as we equip, that's what it does. Uh, on equip grants one slot. Uh, grants between zero and eight strength at random. That's on equip. So we, we've got one person that can give two slots to someone else. Or we can have one person with extra strength. I need the slots. We need the slots, don't we? What are we thinking, guys? What are we thinking? What are you shouting at? Let me know if I've uh, if I've got something wrong here. Do I want to give a massive stat increase to someone, uh, and then hope for an equipment slot later on down the line, or do I get two extra equipment slots by losing one? I think we should get the stat boost. We've gone stat boost, guys. Please, please let me know in the comments if I've done something wrong there. Uh, that's a stat boost. Okay, so what have we got here? We've got blind. Once per battle, regen. Let's give him the stat boost. Because he's living the dream, isn't he? He's living the dream. Unequip. Equip. Now, we can't unequip. Oh, he only got two stat boosts. See, we can't. I thought he said you can't unequip it. We're just swapping it over to people. Let's have a look. No, it's locked. What was this one again? I oh, got plus one strength as well. Um, I guess I guess that's all right, isn't it? That's all right. On spawn, we'll keep that as it is. Um. What are we getting in this shrine? What do you think of the game so far, guys? This is the first look to it. Oh, yes. Okay. So, the reason why I did that was... I mean, it's got more health. But it's got... Uh, terms amount of damage dealt to a target. Okay, that's that one. Okay. Does it have any... Does it have any... Attack? Attacks the same target again once. Okay. I think this will be a good one. This will be a good one for... Here, that unequipped. Oh, it's got two equipment slots as well. Oh, it's worked out perfectly, guys. It's worked out perfectly. Right, this is what I'm going to do. This is what I'm going to do. Okay, so we're going to give it here. This gives it a stat boost. So now it's five. We only lost one strength there. Um, regen on attack. Okay, that's what we want to do. We want to regen on attack. We want this guy to attack. Okay, we've lost one extra shot for the rotation. Uh, attacks the same target once again. Okay. That's what we want. Okay, we've got a battle here. Let's jump into this. Let's see what this battle... Now, uh, we've got a couple of new things there. So, let's uh, let's see how this, this works out. Oh, straight in with a hit. Rotate right. So, if we rotate right, we're going to get an extra hit in. Okay. He's going to hit... And then we're going to get a smack there. And we're going to get a mirror. Oh, okay. It's incapacitated, so we shouldn't have... Okay. My bad. We've all made mistakes there. Okay, we got, we got a hit then. He was only a one. Uh, we have to rotate. 
Uh, I would say get Dender off him. There we go. Uh, if we rotate in, we're getting your man back in. I suppose we could hit him. But here we go. Let's rotate here. Hit. Incapacitated. Rotate. Oh, is he going to mirror the rotate, isn't he? Let's see what that... There we go. He's... Oh, he just, he just killed me. He just killed me. He's incapacitated. So he's, he's just he just mirrored... Yeah, he's mirrored the switch, not his attack. Oh, it's not looking good, guys. Not looking good. <laughs> oh, no. This poison. Right, can we get rid of this guy? Right, let's switch. Grab him. That's going to hit him. He's going to hit. He's going to hit. Now, what I can do is... Ends current turn and revolves a dice. Completes previous action. That was a hit. Target a KO. Camera revive and heals 50% of his HP. That is what we want. We're going to use that. Let's get him back. Let's get him back here, okay, guys? But also... 10. He's on 8. He's on 8 at the minute. Let's... Hey, let, let's use... Hey. We can't take him with us. We can't take it with us. Let's use these. Ends current turn and re-rolls all dice. Okay, so we've had our go. We've had our go now. There we go. They didn't have their go. They didn't have their go. We, uh... That's awesome. That is awesome, that is, because we've just... They've skipped their go. Uh, we could bulk him up. It's a random rotation. We need, uh... Bellord in there, don't we? Ah, we've got him. Perfect. There he is. We need it. We needed a 10. I didn't think the 5 was going to get a boost. So that's why. Okay. So now, it's a clash attack. This is actually going to nail him. Um, that's going to nail him. And we have to use the mirror as well. He's blind. Should miss. We got lucky with the blind. We got lucky with the blind. Um, okay, so this is going to take this is going to take that off him. Energy shock. Repeats previous action. Energy shock. Hit. Energy shock. Okay, right. Then we're going to rotate, which is going to get a six hit. Seven. Okay. He's going to clash, but he's just cleaned him out. He's cleaned him out. But he has to mirror that. So he's hit him twice. And he's uh wish for plot man, that was tough. That one was tough. <laughs> that was one where you have to like proper think about it as well. Um Lightly heals the whole team. Oh, we need a revive. We need a revive. We used a lot of the uh the L button at the top. But we got through it. Now we've got the uh, we got the brewberries. Okay, grants one strength to the chimera of your choice. We know which one this is going to. I know we should even even spread it out, but uh, let's send it our boy here, okay? Uh, black market, abandoned tent, uh, the brood tree. What's the? Ooh. We got fifty-seven coins, by the way, guys. I completely forgot we were getting coins for this. We got more coins for this. Okay, let's get an abandoned tent and get the extra. That's what we want. We want the extra thing on him. Slot on him. Uh, I wanted to give. Give him that. So I can give him that. Okay, that's fine. Um, there's a black market shop here. But I wonder what the traveller does. I don't want to randomly go into the traveller in case I've done something wrong. Hello, dice folk. 
please have a look. <laughs> That's what he says. Um, guys, guys, I'm in love with this game. This is out on the 20th of June. Please check it out. I'm playing it on the Nintendo Switch right now. Uh, let me know what you think of this uh, this video and this game so far. Old Team Games Guard. Okay, that's pretty cool, but that's that's a that's the thing up there. Target a KO, Chimera, revives it and fully heals. Oof, yes. Small die that lasts only for one battle. Okay, that was decent. You remember we've had that before. Uh, gains eight, uh, plus eight, max HP. Once equipped, cannot be... Okay, these are all cursed again. Plus three for the rest of the turn. Just for the turn, okay. Oh, that's when, he, when he's a lead. Okay. Um... Once per battle, and fix the amount of poison equal to attack of strength. Poison at the end of the turn, and effective primary takes an amount of damage equal. So that's at the end of the turn. This would be quite decent to be put on on uh, our 10. It's got 10 strength. Um, I want to grab these dice. You saw how valuable these dice were. Um, okay, so. It's max HP. That is decent. Uh, eight. Eight is what we need. Um, poison though that's what we want ah we need one more we haven't yeah we are short on gold sorry dude just rock up into your shop we have spent loads though he didn't give us any discount did he uh blind blind is a really good one it's it's, it's too good it's too good not to have okay so what we're going to do we're going to equip it on here because he's got 10 strength He's got 10 strength, and we're going to inflict poison at the end of the turn, uh, equal to the attacker's strength. So he's 10. That's why that's why I've put it on him. Okay, uh, we're back here again. Uh, get that get that back in there. Let's have a look at Brutri. There's no elites. There's no, oh, there's elite battle. That means that means the boss is like over here somewhere, isn't it? Let's look at the tree. Equipment choice. There we go. Right. So this is like. It's, it's a roguelike game, guys, obviously, but we're using dice to battle. We're obviously controlling them as well, but also um, we are collecting chimeras. So it's got a bit of everything. I love it. I love it. Self-inflicted six uh, six burn. What? If the item holder is alive at the end of the battle, it will consume the item and benefit its effects. When attacked, an affected chimera takes it. So we get burnt in the battle at the start. And we get a plus 10 max HP if we end the battle alive. That's a gamble, isn't it? Uh, battle start grants leech to opposing leader. Uh, okay. After attacking, an effective chimera heals itself for an amount of HP equal to the amount of damage dealt. But we get a max HP if we survive. Oof. Okay. Self inflicts taunt. Okay. An effective chimera is the designated target for the next opposing attack. I suppose that's probably that's probably better, isn't it? This one is we're gonna get burn every single attack. Six burn, that is. That's six burn. So he's only got We have to we have to kill him straight away. I reckon this, we get the extra 20, 20 gold. We could buy something with that. We're gonna have to, yeah. On another day, we probably would have had, uh, we would have had something else. Let's have a look at the traveller. Let's see what the traveller says. He's been standing there since day one. Let's have a look. See what he's saying. Give ten gold, gain max HP, increase in equipment. Give nine gold, gain strength, increase in equipment. Oof. We need, we need more HP. I know we need more strength, but we could just get more attacks out of it. Um, there's 10 gold thank you have this it ain't much I know but it's a, it's all I have it's all I have now dude is he gone or can we go back in yeah he's gone okay uh, what's this okay is this is self inflicted taunt so we can get extra gold Spawn inflicts incapacity. Passive. Plus 14 max HP. You know what?
this will be good here. He's not going to be the start. So if we leave him, he's incapacitated until the end of the turn. Then the next turn, he'll be able to actually fight. But he'll get a max HP. I'm trying to think. How do you change? Here we go. Okay. Yeah, so I don't want him to actually have a... Uh, I don't want him to be the, the first one then, do I? So he goes up anyway. He's gone down. And he's attacked. trying to think what uh, what would be best for blind is t blind is too good though isn't it it's too good it's only once per battle though whereas at least this heals oh it's, it's once per battle okay it doesn't heal but we want that 20 gold don't we we want that 20 gold We're gonna have to take the hit. We'll have to take the hit. We also need to give this to someone. Let's use the coin. We can get 20 coin. We get 20 coin from this. This is a normal battle. We've got normal battle here. This is gonna open up stuff. But we don't have. We're probably going to die here, guys, because we don't have um, much health compared to everyone else. Look, 26, 28, and 30. This is why we've got to be a bit a bit smarter with stuff. Yeah, we've got... He's incapacitated. Goglin. Uh, he's attacked him twice. Don't really want to swap him round. We can do. On the off chance something was going to happen then. That way. He's he's asleep, so that's that's perfect. Okay, so what we need to do is we've got to swap free rotation. We need to get Boglin out. Get Boglin out. Attack. Attack. He's gone. We have to wake him up. This is not good. Clash attack. Missed. We've hit him. Clash attack. Hit him. He's hit us. He's dead blind. So this is going to miss because he's blind. We've hit him. Oh! Okay. Now it's two on one. We should attack. Attack. Oh, we got really lucky with the roll of the dice there. And does that mean we get 20? We get 20. Yes. Uh, okay. Grants one strength to the whole team. Everyone gets a strength buff there. Awesome. But that also means we've got 20 plus 20 gold by using that one, uh, one equipment there, which means we can put this back on. Uh, equip. Awesome. That was really good. Uh, we've got a bonfire as well. That is what we need. We've got a die smith. So let's have a look at the die smith. See what, they're, see what they've got going on for us. We're doing well with this run. Grants an ally leader an amount of thorn equal to its own. Thorn has to be an attack and effective primary deals... Was attacker an amount of damage equal to thorn value. 
So Thorn is strength. So we could give that Belloid. Um, okay, a small die that only lasts for one battle. How many of these can we have? If we have two, that means we've got five. The regular die ready to be customized. Ooh, that's 30 as well. Okay. Target an ally, it gains plus two strength for the rest of the battle, two strength. Uh, target any Chimera leader, attacks it. Okay. I think that can be pretty decent, isn't it? Oh, this is a basic. Oh, okay, so we get an automatic. Okay, so we always get four dies. Ah, yes. Look at these. Okay. I'm learning this as you guys are going along, dude. Uh, I am. Okay. I mean, Thorn's, Thorn's quite good, but I think if we can get another dice. So that will give us five. We've got five dice in, the, in that battle there. We need to get another nine coins. That's the thing. Where can we get another nine coins from? We've got a bonfire. We've got an elite battle. We've got a normal battle. Uh, oh, let's get the shrine tray. chest. See what's in here. Nine coins. Exactly what we needed. Ah, oh, the gods have smiled on us. Right. Revives and or lightly heals the Chimera of your choice. Uh, heals all team. Okay, that's perfect. I'll tell you why this is perfect, guys. Because we're next to a bonfire. Oh, it didn't. It lightly healed it. It didn't heal all of it. Because I was going to say, we can go into the bonfire now. Um, let me go to the black market first. Like I can say because we need we need more equipment slots. That's what we need. Target a KO Chimera, revives it and fully heals. Whole team gains guard. That's clutch, man. That is clutch. Well, that just gains an extra eight. Guard. We're gonna have to. We're gonna have to go. Having a whole team on guard is clutch, and also um, having uh, that KO on there. I know we were going to get the extra dice, but we've got the dice here. It's just pure greed now, isn't it? Pure greed. Okay, so let's jump out of this. Um, we've got an elite battle. I don't know how I feel about fighting the elite battle. How's that? We've got 29... 14 and 9. It's not good, man. It's not good. Because we've got a boss battle as well. Let's have a look at this battle. Let's have a look at this battle. See, if we, see how many coins we can get from this. They are high HP compared to us, though. Look at that. Okay, your man's incapacitated. We've got a free rotation. That's what we've got. Um, free rotation means we, we choose we choose the rotation okay so what we can do is we're going to rotate him anyway that's that's basic that's we'll rotate him okay hit uh Energy shock. Hit him again. But he's got a four. Let's move him back here. Let's get Dendo off him because he's asleep. He wasn't attacking when he was asleep. Oh, we just woke him up. I think, yeah, I think we just woke him up. Okay. <laughs> we just nailed him. Okay. Great. Okay, now we've got rotation again. This is a free rotation. We could... No, I want to I wanna hit him with that. So now he's on 11. He's on 11. Okay, we get rid of him. We get rid of him anyway. Now he's incapacitated. That's fine. Uh, we are going to... So 
Go take him out. Something happened to his attack then. He got an attack stat. We've just been hit. Right, so we've got uh, rotation. Get Boglin back in. I think your man is incapacitated. So. Is he incapacitated for the next turn? Just double guarded. I don't think... I think we need to just... Oh, we did hit him. Okay. I thought he was incapacitated for this turn. Maybe that was the last turn then. Okay, he's only got four there. So we're going to attack. We can't rotate. Energy shock. Attack. That's another seven. He's just killed them all in. He just killed them all in four hits. GG's. And we got 15 coins. We didn't need the other man. Plus 12 coins. We've got 12 coins from it as well. He's just giving coins away. That works out perfectly. The elite one's going to be so much harder, though. Okay, we've got 27 coins. Let's look at the black market, see what we've got here. Do you guys get the gist of the game? The idea of how to play it and what we're doing here? Enter lead. Passive. Gain 8 max HP. Like that. That is pretty decent. That's so tempting. That's so tempting. Especially when they've got low HP right now. I am moaning about how uh, how much low their HP is. Um, we've got these actually. Okay, so we've got target combo with the leader and attack it. We can't buy that. Target an ally, it gains two strength for the rest of the battle. Okay, this is the, these are just strength. We can buy another dice. Okay, this is what we wanted from earlier. Let's see if we can get see if we can get six dice on the go. Um, okay, so Thorn. Mm, right. Okay, so I'm just trying to think. We're short. We're short for that other one. It's very tactical, isn't it? Consider, well, I mean, we, we do, obviously. We can go through it again. Once we die, we just go through it again. But uh, you do have to think about it. 17. 17. Great, so we need number 9. I think in that case... We have to go to the bonfire. We can't fight the elites without going to the bonfire. Collect your loot. Okay, so we've got rest, revives and strongly heals all chimeras. Uh, increases uh, stats or equipment slot to chimera your choice. See, we could do another equipment slot, but we need we need we need them strong heals. There we go. Okay. I mean, we don't have to shoot. We don't have to go there, do we? We can just go straight to the boss battle. We're not gonna, we're not gonna gain anything but gold here, guys. We're not gonna gain anything but gold, uh, and then we're gonna be heavily damaged for for that. Okay, so let's go to the back market, and then we'll just we'll just go to the boss fight. We'll just do that. Okay, nothing in there. Nothing in there. We were in there earlier. I don't know why I went in there. Watch her go. There she is. The reason why I'm coming back here is because we're going to, we're going to the boss fight. We're going to the boss fight. I want to make sure I've got everything. I can use everything. Obviously, if we use that at the start of the battle, every time your man gets hit, we can um, we can hit back with that amount of damage as well. Oh, I put the wrong person as leader. 160. Whew. Oh, he's incapacitated anyway. Okay, so what we want to do is... Listen to the music. Don't forget about the music, guys. 
one battle. We want to use this. <laughs> we can. We can. You know what I'm going to do, guys? For this battle, let's make me... I'm in the wrong place. I want you to see what we've got here. So we've got six. Six dice. Okay. The whole team uh, has got guard. Okay. Uh, we can revive some one person and fully heals it. We also have grants uh, to an ally leader an amount of thorn equal to its own strength. What I want that for, I want that for Belloid. I want that for Belloid. So we're not going to use it yet. Um, leader swap. Belloid is incapacitated though. Oh, we've got thorn here as well. Well, we're a bit lucky then, aren't we? Rotate left. So this is going to... Well, he's going to attack. Gargullet. It's proper. Yeah, it's a proper hefty thing, isn't it? Let's leader swap. We're going to put him leader. We're also going to give him guard. He's incapacitated. We're going to give him Thorn, because this is what I want to, because he's 11. Um, what I want to do is hit him, but it's going to miss. That's fine. I want to rotate this. And use his that. Choose ally. Oh, what's, what is it? Oh, he's just hitting us, that's all. Okay, so he's got guards, that's fine. So he's not going to do any damage, but we're going to smack him back. Uh, charge. What does charge do? Boss gains one intelligent. A stat that's not... Okay. Blinky value within the current area. That's... Okay, we have to use it anyway. There's our next shot. Okay. So we should use Thorn. We've got poison there. Rotate right is awesome. Uh, bleed. Ah, oh, there we go. So basically, we can flick bleed... Onto the leader, uh, opposing um, leader, and then what we do is rotate and then takes damage to the bleed value. Okay, so we'll inflict bleed, then we're going to rotate anyway because it's going to bring our bird back in to hit him, then bleed. Am I right? When does it inflict bleed? Oh, now it's affected. Okay, right, okay. Now we've got leader swap. He's incapacitated. Leader swap. Let's get your man back in. And what I'm going to do is... He's incapacitated now. So now he's poisoned. Awesome. Uh, we're going to have to... Oh, we can't... Can't rotate. So we've took the hit there. I've still got the guard. I'm still thinking about the guard. We've got the guard, which is, uh, which is quite important. Here we go again. We've got Entangle. Inflicts Entangle on the opposing leader. And an effective Chimera misses its next rotation as the leader and must try to rotate once in order. Okay, so you have to rotate, but you can't do it. Okay. Uh, we've got a free rotation. This is good. This is good. So we're going to rotate. Hit. That's one hit. And then we're going to rotate back. Guard. We need to hit this person here. For the next person to be entangled, which is this, which means he can't rotate out. Oh. He's hit himself. He can't rotate out, but he has to, and he's hit him, hurt himself there. Okay, that's fine. We've used everything. This is going a little bit better. I mean, I'm not, I'm not, not counting my chickens yet, but this is going a little bit better than I thought it was going to be. 
uh, bleed again. Afflicts no button bleed uh, to alloys. Okay, so we're going to do bleed on this person because last time we did it, that person died. Uh, rotate. We get a hit in there. Bang. And we can swap leader. Just trying to get the 11s in there rather than the 7s. Um, I'm going in for a guard. Whole team uses guards. So we've all got guards on. Um, reckless attack. Incapacitated. That's fine. Uh, charge. It's for his intelligence again. Tim. Okay. 107. It's taking its time, guys. Oh, your man's been hit. They've both been hit. Poisoned as well. Full revive. Thorn. Thorn. Grants to allied leader an amount of thorns equal to its own strength. Yeah, so he's already he's already got thorns. That's what the things are there. We've got thorn here anyway. Uh, we've got attack, energy shock, reckless attack. This could be quite decent. We can get an attack in. Reckless attack. Energy shock. Um, do we do the rotation now? It's a free rotation. Get him in. Get your hit in. He hasn't got thorns, so let's give him thorns as well. So we've got two people with thorns. Uh... Get your... He's not guarded. He's not guarded, you know. But that gives us an option to not have him... Okay, that's fine. We've got to, we've got to revive. Let's hit him again. That missed, because he's incapacitated. Okay. Uh, right, let's rotate. Rotate him out. He's been hit by 10. <laughs> oh. oh, okay. So... He got because he rotated. He got hit. Okay, clash attack, clash attack here. Your man might die here. He's on it. Please don't. No one else hit him. Okay, he's on three, three health. Confusion. Inflicts the amount of confusion equal to alloys strength. Opposing leader. Every time it attacks, an affecting Chimera takes an amount of damage equal to confusion value. Retreat. Why has he got retreat here? No way. Um, I need you to attack first. I need you to rotate. Get rotating. There you go. If we can get a hit. Another hit. Hit. Get a rotate. Free rotation. We want you going that way round. Oh, we can't rotate. I should have just used it on this. Uh, confusion. Plus 10 confusion. We're going to have to save him. We're saving. This guy's going to have to take a hit. But he's got a guard. Awesome. Why has he got retreat? A oh, retreat is in... Okay, that means... I thought it was going to end the battle then. No, no, no. I thought it was going to run off. Oh, your man's dead. I think we've got him though. We've got him. If we get him back in. We got him. <laughs> he got himself. No. Oh, you know what? He doesn't get XP, does he? He doesn't get XP. We might as well just leave him there. We're not going to use that. Guard, rotate, and um, if we rotate. Might as well use Thorn. Leader swap. Bang. Tactical. <laughs> oh, man. What do you think of the game, guys? What do you think of the game? I'm going to read all the comments on this. Uh, thank you so much for being in there as well. If you haven't already, please like uh, the video. Uh, I'm, I'm a Twitch streamer as well, so please follow me over on Twitch, TS Villa, and uh, make sure you subscribe to this YouTube channel as well. Okay, right, so... Attacked, small chance of healing by double the amount of damage received. 
that's quite that's quite decent. Uh, once per battle, after receiving a debuff, did it say double? Damage received. Okay, not not inflicted. Okay. Uh, once per battle, after receiving a debuff, self purifies. Okay, so that's all right. revive. Strongly heals. Crack teapot. That's quite handy. That's quite handy, especially for where we are right now. Fifteen percent. So if we get hit by ten, we receive a twenty. That seems too good to be true, surely. But we've also got this revive. Strong heals. Is it only one u one use? I think I think it's got to be that, isn't it? It's got to be that. Well, there we go, guys. The first two. That's the first two worlds. These are all going to be different, guys. So your runs are going to be different to my runs. Uh, every single time you do a run, it's going to be different. Uh, we've got a cursed chest. Great start. Let's have a look here. Quantic beans. If alive, small chance of increasing a random stat forever. 10%. Um, hey? If alive, small chance of increasing a random stat forever. So this just there's no starting thing at all. We just have to survive the fight. Okay. Battle end. Uh, if in the lead, heals 5 HP to all its allies. Is that at the end of battle? Just every single battle. And 5 HP to all allies at the end of each battle. Oh, a small chance of increasing random stat forever. Okay, so it's a small chance. But this heals 5. I think we're going to have to go with that heal. Oh, your traveller's here. Let's have a look. Let's see what the traveller's saying now. If tear 11 gold, gain healing equipment. Gain max HP increasing equipment. <sighs> guys, guys, what are we saying? We can only afford one of these. Healing equipment. We're going to heal ourselves or we're going to have a match HP. I'm guessing for this... For this part of the game... We need match HP increasing. Let's have a look. Let's see what we got. Don't have many slots though. Passive loses one gold up to three times. Plus thirteen match HP. So we can just keep this on. What is going on with this game? Plus fourteen max HP. self inflicts and incapacitated. We need to change that as well, by the way. Okay. Let's put this on. Equip this to him. So now we're in the 30s. Uh, if in the lead, heals five damage to all allies. Crack teapot is quite nice. That's quite good. But we're running out of stuff here. <coughs> right. Okay. So we're going to go with this. We got a shrine here. Let's let's uh, let's get a calm area. Let's see what's going on here. I kind of want to swap the middle one though. He had high health, but he didn't have good attack. Oh, here we go. Now we're talking. Let's get your man involved. Spell. Clash attacks with the opposing leader. Oh, so he's got spell. We don't have we don't have a spell here. Okay, so he's eight. He's eight. He's gonna be better than this one. He was good, whatever. Right. He's got equipment that would be lost. Ah, oh, because we've run out of things at the top. We 
We need the blind. How do I, how do I go over? We're going to have to leave him, aren't we? I don't want to lose that equipment. It's eight. An extra two, but it's an extra... It's tough. It's tough. I shouldn't have equipped him. I shouldn't have equipped him. We, we'll leave him. We'll leave him because we can find him from another shrine. Before we go to the next shrine. Let's see what that says. Okay, let's have a look. So there's another shrine over here. There's a shrine down here. Um, but we need... Um, what we need... Let's do this one here because we need uh, we need equipment slots because we're gonna run out of room to grab equipment. Oh, 65, 66. Attack. See, that's a zero because it's incapacitated him. Okay, so we will. It's a waste of attack. He's took a hit. And he's he just won't he just won't stop hitting. Uh, okay, so uh, clash attack is going to hit himself. It looks like. Okay, let's just let's just get this guy down. Oh, he just won't stop hitting him. They're all blind. There's a random taunt. And we have to rotate. That's it. Okay, the focus went up. We're getting more stuff now. Ah, oh, the bird is the bird is dying. Okay. Um, what happened then? Best thing I can do is probably yeah rotate. There we go. We use their mirror. Uh, we use their rotation. Uh, we'll use a rotation. Kill him off. Oh. Why didn't you go for him? can't change it so we're just gonna have to waste it on him I think I'm happy with that I don't want to oh yeah we want to rotate we want to rotate uh, because we need him on a rotation but not that kind of rotation okay let's get rid of this guy here loot Z Sixes, random taunt, uh, clash. It's focused. Oh man, I'm glad I kept him now. I think it was his last attack. Uh, freeze one. Okay, let's get him back in. We're going to. We're going to hit him. He's incapacitated. Uh, we're going to rotate. Uh, he's next. Attack. Rotate. Get him back in. There's the attack. Beautiful. Beautiful. GG, he's there. But he's frozen. He's frozen. He's dead. That's just me and Zvindle. Random. Rotate right. He can't rotate right. We are going to rotate him out because he's frozen. Oh! The camera's just been hit. I want to see. Get that rotation. Then he can't mirror it because he can't rotate. Uh, buff him up. Attack. He's incapacitated now for another this turn no he's done for this turn okay that's fine uh, we're gonna bulk him up we try and get a random rotation no let's bulk him up bulk hit rotation he's 
frozen, but he still hits. He still hits. Okay. It's random. He's hitting him because he's frozen. Oh, they're back and forth. Absolute slamming match. Okay. Bulk him up. Finish him off. Don't hit yourself. There you go. He didn't hit himself. Victory. So addictive, guys. I didn't realize how long this video's been. <laughs> a thorn token. Okay, we want a thorn token. Of course, we want that. Uh, Lightly heals the whole team. That is very welcome in this stage of the game. What have we unlocked, though? What's around us? There was stuff around us. Okay, we've got. Oh, this is what we wanted. Uh, grants 2 plus HP to the Chimera of your choice. Grants 2 plus. Access speed to the Chimera, your choice. That's what we want. Uh, mate, it's, it's the old faithful. He's the old faithful. We're, we're proper... Proper loving him, man. Get him involved. Uh, but what I do want to do, though, is... Attacks the same target again once. That's every time he attacks. I think we're going to have to... Can't carry two... How do we... How do we... Oh, we've got to discard it. percent of damage what are we getting rid of thirteen max HP like this is let's get rid of let's get rid of the, the frozen Unequip. We need that. We need that. And then uh, slightly increases one or multiple stats. We need this because then he's better. I feel like we can discard him either. Let's uh, let's get rid of this, okay? And then we're gonna unequip this. Let's go to the shrine. We need more equipment slots. That's what we need. Okay, now who we've got? There's another one. We've unlocked two here. Okay, he's a t he's 25, but he's eight, uh, eight strength. Your man here has got spell clash attacks with the opposing leader. Okay, that's fine. If health is not full, attacks the opposing leader. So if he hasn't got a full health, he attacks anyway. The start of our turn. That's quite good because he doesn't have to actually be on the uh, in the lead. I do think we need this though because we we were actually. Um, we're actually uh, at the point now where we need loads of HP. Let's play really, really smart. Okay, let's look at the uh, die smith. See what's uh, see what's cracking here. Hmm. Two away from that. Um, oh, we can have another jester dice. Okay, that's sixty though. That is sixty. Target an unused die. Which is, which is re rolled. Eh, that could be quite good. I don't think these are anything. I mean, we need we need this, obviously. We 100% need this. Um, okay. Right. Now, uh, this guy's got three equipment slots. I did forget to see that, actually. I didn't see that. Um, we can move the camera down now a bit because we've uh, I mean we've got four dice but we can move the camera down a bit it was only because we had five dice didn't we die dice please let me know in the comments okay uh, if in the lead heals five HP to his allies okay so at the end of every battle that's what it's saying that's what we're doing uh, once per battle that's what we want we wanted that Slightly increases one stat or regen. Uh, 
that's a revive. Okay, so we um, we'll have this because this slightly increases the stats. Okay, got a plus one strength. Awesome. Did we have we been in there? No, we've been in there. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is we've got a battle up here. All right, let's grab let's grab this battle here because that's gonna unlock two things. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. I thought we were going to die quite a couple of times, and I thought I was just going to show you the mechanics and everything, but uh, we seem to be doing really, really well here. Quite clever. Quite clever. Not me, the game. Okay, some chimeras like this one can trigger their abilities on command. While inspecting the chimera, I can validate it is to trigger spells. Yes, yeah, so that's our new one. However, it would cost them mana to do so. I must keep an eye on it. Okay, where's his mana? Five. He's got five mana. That's, uh, sorry guys, just above where my camera is right now. Five. It says five underneath his name. There. There. Okay, so he's got five mana. Am I triggering something? Okay, that's his, uh, that's what we're doing. Clash attack. But he got hit as well, but they're all blind not leader when he's still attacking that's a great shout to have him in um, okay so we're gonna hit him with this we're gonna hit him with this he's incapacitated damn it and we're gonna rotate and hit him with this okay um, he's got guard we're gonna swap this guy give him guard clash attack missed everything missed we just smacked him, got rid of his guard. So it's a wasted move. That's awesome. We're now burnt. Uh, if we rotate left, we get your man back in. Bulk him up. Hit. Nope. Random rotation. Will we get goal? We need goal. Ah, oh, damn it. Uh, get him in. Um, rotation. We're going to rotate this way to get. That way to get your man involved. Uh, I also want to hit him so he can use his mana. I wonder, does his mana refresh every fight? There's only one way to find out, really, isn't there? Uh, let's have that there. Attack, and we attack him back. He lost his guard. Oh, he's one hit away. He's one hit away, guys. Rotate. He's hitting. Uh, free rotation. We're going to rotate left. Oh, no, 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 no. We're going to hit him. We're going to hit him. Then we're going to rotate left, which brings the bird in. Hit him. Beautiful. Uh, he's going to rotate out. He's going to attack us, but kill himself. Yes. Okay, two down. Two down. Tactical man, turn based, turn based, Mon monster capturing, uh, dice game. I love it, I love it, man. Okay, so energy shock. Does any what does energy shock do? We're about attacking leader. Deals. Uh, same, it's the same damage. Oh, what could do this? 34, 36. So that's going to do more damage. This is going to mirror. No, that didn't mirror it. You're going to use it once per turn. Okay. Oh, he's dead. Well, we couldn't rotate out anyway. So I think he was always going to die. Um, we bulk him up. Of course we don't. We bulk him up. Get your boy involved. Bang, bang. 13. Right, so we've got 44 gold. The aim was to get 60, because we get an extra die. Die? Dice? I don't know. Maybe I should call that this stream die or dice. Um, okay. We've got a, uh, a die smith as well. A bonfire. Okay, so this is a confusion. Target Chimera heals 50% of its... There you go, so that's 50% of the dice. 
plus 14. No more dice games, guard. So we have to use everyone. Master Obi, it's called. <laughs> An affected Chimera does not receive damage from the next attack. Okay, that's fine. So that's if we use all the dice. Uh, suffering from debuffs, increase the amount of damage dealt. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're good with that. We do need to get your man back, though. Yeah, we need to get him back. Let's go to the bonfire. Which is a bit of a shame, because we could do with an extra... Equipment slot. Wait, hold on. Should we do that? Get an extra equipment slot. Uh, let's give it your man here. And in the next fight, we can revive him. He's likely to... Well, I'm guessing he's likely to... Uh, well, he's not, is he? Uh, equipped to that. So we're going to swap this. He's likely to die next. So revive... Uh, he strongly heals. Okay. So, we're trying to play this smart now. Okay. If I can. If I can play it smart, guys. Um, this one looks like it's going to open up some stuff. So let's jump into this. Uh, I'm going to use a revive to get your man back. Battle starts. Here we go. Let's get a revive. Here we go. Oh. No. Oh, just... What are you doing? Use that on him. Him, there we go. So he's back. He's got full strength. Um, we can also get him in a rotation. And hit him again. The other one was incapacitated, so we couldn't use him. It's random. And then we're going to swap him again. Oh, no. The other bird. Use that. Yeah, so he's got five mana, so it's five every fight. Okay. That's uh that's very interesting to know. Bang, he's gone. We don't need to worry about the rotation now. Um Nootsie, should we get rid of him? He's incapacitated, that's fine. We'll end the turn. Uh we're not getting much with the idols here. We're getting some idols here. I don't like that. Um, rotate left which is next one is that one in that case we're going to have to use your use your ability uh, hit him I'm trying to think is it worth rotating him he's going to get hit uh, like there's a rotation there's another rotation if he dies he's got the revive equipment that's what I'm thinking here guys uh, he's got eight here, so if we uh, we swap him with this, there's a hit. Uh, another smack. Get yourself involved. Hit. Yes. Okay. Uh, we do need him to freeze. Maybe he should have hit him before he froze. He's hit himself. Don't ask me why. Because we couldn't rotate him. He's mirrored. He's hit me. Uh, we do need to rotate him though. Energy shock. Bang. Reckless. He's almost dead. What is this random thing going to do? That missed. We're going to hit him back? No, we aren't. Okay. Oh, in that case, energy shock. Bang. Off he goes. 60. We've got 60 coins now. We know what we're doing with the 60 coins, guys. Which means I have to move my, uh, I have to move my uh, camera up here a little bit. Up here, look like that. There you go. Uh, we've got some debris. What was in the debris? I didn't read it. I didn't read what was in there. Uh, shrine chest. 15 gold. Yes, please. And revives and or lightly heals the chimera of your choice. Lightly heals. Oh, well, there's no point. There's no point with this one here.
Uh, he's got revive. Right, lightning heals this. Okay. So we're taking a hit. I'm just. I was trying to think. What have we, what have we got? It was a. Uh, we've had the bonfire, haven't we? We've had the bonfire. Let's get that dice. Oh, he wasn't in here. He was in the uh, dice smith. I can't put the game down, guys. I can't put the game down. <laughs> love it. Love it. Thank you so much. Uh, good shepherd of entertainment. Uh, we're going to buy the jested dice. There we go. Sold. Now we've got five dice. Um, but then obviously we can increase it with these. Absolutely dirty, isn't it? Okay, so we don't want to re-roll. I guess we will have to go for, like, these instead. Uh, we don't have anyone with um, intelligence. That's the thing. Not even me. Okay, we're on 13. I'm thinking one of these is going to reveal a boss battle. Surely. Another look up here. Thorns. Okay. Thorns are thorns are gonna be uh, we're gonna have to use that on two people. Oh, there's only two here. This is awesome. Okay, right, so you can see the dice there. I'm not in the way. You just can't see uh, Metro's Skilleros. Is that his name? We've got a, oh, we've got a joker here. So it takes the team in a random direction. After it is rolled, all unused hollow dice are re-rolled. Unused. Let's use him. Right, he's been hit. He's killed himself, but he's got the revive. Right? Or does he... Random rotation, that's going to hit him. Then we're going to random rotation. Everything's going to re-roll. Um, we can't rotate again. We we'll just, we'll just go for it. I mean, it's, it's blocked anyway. It's blocked. Uh, we want him to attack. Because everyone's got 10. We don't want that. Surprise that he's not. This is a Joker dice. This is going to keep doing it. Uh, there we go. Attack. Uh, re roll. Free rotation. Oh, this has worked out right. Look at that. Oh, he's missed. Incapacitated himself, didn't he? Rotation, clash attack, it's focused. Oof, that is a proper hit. And he's hit himself as well, he's hit himself. Uh, energy shock. So, one of these is he's going to block one of these. Gonna... He's left with one. We got a random rotation. Uh, free rotation. Um, he's gonna die. We have to sacrifice him. Kill him. Then this guy is going to... It's a random thing. That's missed. He's going to freeze. Down to four. Okay, so that's fine. That's fine. We're going to... We're going to... Hit him with that. Hit him with that. We're then going to hit him with this. 
And this is going to miss. We might as well leave it then. Hit him instead. It's going to miss, so there's no point. There's no point, really. There you go. But at least that re rolled. Idle. Attack. Mirror. Got him. What was that? that? So when he revives, when he revives, he gets. Hmm. So when that guy revives, that's when he strong heals. That's an elite battle. Okay, so we did that. We did all that for an elite battle. Great. Uh, right. Okay. This is getting tough. It's getting tough now. I sacrificed him because I thought he was going to be. Uh, I thought he was going to revive. So we got an eight and a four. Guys, we're dead. We're dead here, guys. There's nothing. There's nothing for us to use. Nothing. There's nothing in the shop. Listen to the music there. The music is pretty. As we're in the shop, the music went like a bit, a bit quiet then. A bit quiet. Okay, we could do that. do with that grab that is that all or was that just one target just a target okay we can save you man save you man okay well I think we've I think we're gonna die the next fight guys anyway uh, which is fine on spawn if we're not in the lead we're not gonna be in the lead so we won't Go for it. <laughs> Let's run with it, guys. Let's run with it. Let's see what's going on here. That's awesome. That we got five dice there. But now we've literally got what? <laughs> twelve. We got twelve health between two of us. Uh, okay. Let's. Uh, we have to. We have to bring him in. Rotation. That's what I need. Yeah, let's do that. And then the other things are going to read. Re yeah, they're going to re roll. Ah, awesome. Okay. So we can bulk him up for a bit and hit him. He's incapacitated. We'll have to, we'll have to swap him so he can take the hits. Uh, we need to swap you. Oh, no, it's Saved on two then. Oh, he's hitting him though, isn't he? Oh, he's incapacitated again. Oh, I don't need to do that. Rotation. Hit him. Energy shock. Right, this is going to be rolled here. Which is an extra hit, but it's missed. It's missed, obviously, because he's he's done that. Uh, taunt. Uh, we, uh, free rotation. We want that way round. So it's a five instead. He's dead. But we're still going strong. Thorns has killed him. GG's. Swap him. Swap him over. 
His focus went up. Ah, oh, he's guarded as well. Damn, I didn't see that. I just used him anyway, for, just for the sake of it. Oh, there's one left. Oh, this is it, guys. This is it. We can't do idols. Reckless attack. We've got to reckless attack him at least. That kills him. It's got to re-roll everything. Uh, yeah, but we can't. We can't attack. That was a good run, though. God, honestly, what? Almost two-hour run. Can't really. Uh, can't really uh, moan at that. There we go. Defeat. GGs, though, guys. How? I Please let me know. You must still, you must have enjoyed it to still be here in the video. Uh, I really, really enjoyed that. I did not want it to end. Uh, right, so there we got. You can now loot breakable equipment. Ooh, okay, that's pretty cool. Uh, the Wandering Hero has appeared. Here he is. His content added to the compendium. Standard battles. Uh, okay, we've got 14 battles there. You can recruit this new Chimera in shrines. Caractal. I just want to read my things here. Standard battles, 14. Elite battles, 1. Boss battles, 2. End goal, 25. Look at that, man. That was pretty awesome. That was a pretty awesome run. We got to uh, we got to world stage 3. Next unlock is there. That was awesome, guys. That was awesome. Uh, right, so that has been Dice Folk. There we go, guys. That was Dice Folk. What did you think of the video? Please let me know in the comments. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you do like it and also subscribe to this YouTube channel. Thank you so much to Good Shepherd Entertainment for gifting us a code for release day. This is Dice Folk. It's out on the 20th of June. We're playing it on Nintendo Switch. Go and pre order it now, guys, and make sure you enjoy it. Tell me how far you got on your first playthrough. That was my third. I did two off um, off this stream. This is the uh, the review stream. This game is absolutely awesome. The different types of Chimera that you get, that you fight against as well. Um, I didn't realize that you could have more than the three dice that you actually start with, which is absolutely awesome. We had a two hour and two minute run. Um, and that just felt so good. It felt like a, a probably about a 20 minute run because it was so enjoyable. Uh, each path is going to be different every time you play this game. So what you see on this video right now, you won't get on yours. It is going to be completely different. There were over 100 different chimeras to get, guys. So make sure you check out every single one of these. Play it as many times as you want. Hopefully you don't get frustrated with it. I think there's an absolutely awesome game. Uh, please go out and buy it. And until next time, guys, I've been TS Villa. I will see you for your next video. Take care.